video of the Twin Nova XY. It's also been made by Multiplex as well now. Taxi it out to the field. This looks really nice. Had it a couple of months now. Had a lot of flights on it. Must have had 100 flights, something like that. Uh, really enjoying it. Good solid flyer. No bad tendencies. Uh, it's running on a 3S 3000. Um, putting together wise, takes no time at all. Just four bolts in the wing and a couple in the tail. Might even be one in the tail, I can't remember now. Uh, nice uh, ball link. Um, nose wheel is pretty good. Got some suspension in it and it's fixed tricycle gear. Um, this, the field's just been cut but it was a bit long uh, the week before and it manages reasonably long grass without any problem. Everything's stock um, and yeah, it just flies great so we'll uh, get her up in the air. Slight breeze today, coming from that sort of direction now, it just seems to be shifting around a little bit. Empty blue sky so I might walk to the other side of the field or I might just fly it down, down that end because there's nobody else here today. Uh, probably take off with half ah, flaps. I've got a bit of elevator mixed in there, about 10% elevator, just to stop any uh, any ballooning. Be about right, I think. Okay, let's go. goes. Flaps, flaps off. And try and keep it fairly tight. It's that third throttle at the moment. Give that some. Still got it. Keep it towards me. Power to climb up. About third, or just one and a half throttle. The wind just kicking it right down, uh, uh, low down. The turbulence off it when it comes through the bushes. Sliding now. Power on at the moment. Now I'm back on for the turn. And keep it low.
Um, this 3S3000, I normally get about, normally bring it in at 8 minutes, but I'd probably go 10 just on, on mixed throttle. If it was full throttle all the time, which I don't normally fly, I would probably uh, stick to 8 minutes. Um, 8 minutes is just nice. Inverted. Just, um, put Flap half pass. flaps on and slow it down a bit. That's half flaps. We'll slow down, we'll keep the half flaps on, bring it around, then we'll go full flaps. She's in the sun there. Flaps full. That's full flaps now. Full flaps into a little bit of a wind, so she will slow down quite nicely. Still full flaps. Put the power up. Flaps up. Flaps off. A little bit of power on. Time she comes. A bit more power. A little bit of a bounce there. the flared it a little bit more just to come down on the rears first I think. Yeah, there she is. Off. I've got the AC brake set. I didn't really need it but I think I just did it accidentally while I was messing around but I've, uh, I've left it on. So yeah, that's the battery I was using. I'll get back to the car and uh, I'll put in the uh, in the description how much is used. We've only been flying for about seven minutes there, six or seven minutes, somewhere around six actually. Uh, well, yeah, you don't have to do anything. The only thing you have to do is just glue the bottom of these ESC covers on. Um, nothing. There's three screws in the tricycle gear. They're all nicely countersunk screws that are used all over. You've got a hatch on the back of the strong ma magnet there for the receiver. Seems to move around a bit. I've got an X8R in there which is just about right really for this. So yeah it's a good strong magnet. It's got one servo to the elevator. Nice ball links. Uh, this tail just sort of kind of clicks in and there's just just the one screw isn't there. Um, flaps come down nice and smooth. And servos. Plastic digital X-Fly. I don't know what make they are but uh, yeah they're fine. There's your rudder. Again, ball link. Uh, it comes with green light for uh, starboard. Uh, a landing light just on the uh, on the port wing, and then you've got a red light on the port wing. Thank you. Uh, yeah, so you can get these off X Fly if you're in. States, I think it's probably Bitgo Hobby or uh, Asia. Uh, in Europe, I think I got one of the last ones. Um, I don't think, oh, Kingsland Models I got this, but I don't think there's anywhere in the UK that stocks them now. Uh, Multiplex have taken it on. I 
exact same plane, just with some of their decals on. But I'm not sure whether they've changed the electronics over or not. Um, but I know it, it's quite a bit more expensive. I've paid 200 GB pounds for this. Um, maybe, maybe touch over with the shipping. Um, but it's quite a bit more if you buy the multiplex one. Hatch wires, nice little tongue, usual arrangement there. Slots in, nice and solid. It does pick up a fair bit of grass through. Uh, it's a 3070C from CNHL G Plus series, three cell. Let's see what's left on it. Oh, it's got a nice strap as well, and uh, big ply tray for the battery. <coughs> Plenty of room to get your hand in there and get your whole fist in quite easy. If you wanted to put FPV gear or anything like that, cameras would be fine. 51%. That's good. Okay. See you all later.